Hi girls, it's Mal from Kai Fit Woodland. We are working on a workout for week two of this core session. Um, this one has two on the lines and usually, uh, we have the room at our facility to set up both lines. Um, if you can do that and then switch when the girls are done on their lines. So each line, they're gonna be on their line for about 10 minutes and then you'll tell them when to go to the other one. Okay, so let's go, to, go through all the exercises on the first line. We have, for the counter, counter's doing box jumps for 10 reps. We know about our box jumps. And then coming down and doing 10 of those upright rows. So shoulders back, leading up with the elbows. Neck is long, shoulders are low. Next exercise on the line, we have Daytona 500s. I like these. They come around the hips into that deadlift, shoulders back. I like to reverse my circle and down. Make sure they're not swinging and then taking it to the front. They want to control that handbag on the way around or kettlebell. Um, then we have our side plank thread the needles. If you have um, dumbbells, try to add those into their top hand. So coming into that side plank, you can modify your knee down if you need it, thread it under, and press it up. Thread it under, press it up. Remind them to pull that hip up nice and strong. Uh, bicep pumpers, I did not specify um, bands or handbags, that's up to you. Coach's choice, okay? So pulse it out on that one. Remind them that a pulse is not full range of motion because you know when you say pulse, they do the opposite thing, sometimes. Then we have the thread the needle on the other side. Ski your abs, stepping or jumping it. You can take it to a box if you need to. Step, step it, or big hop. Keep those booties low. Ooh, not a breath. Single leg rope. So because um, they're just waiting for their counter to be done, I wrote five and five. So single hops, five on one, and five on the other. Okay? Mm. Plie squat hold, hold with band pull apart. I like these. So get low on that plie, turn those toes out, tailbone down. They need a little slack in their rope, open it up and back down. If it ever seems like the pull apart is a little too easy, walk over to them, double up the rope, double up the band, and then add that in, okay? Shoulders low on that one. So the exercises for the second on the line, the counter, <sighs> out of breath. The counter is doing um, 20 box tap backs. So that's just standing on the box. I would go a little lower because I'm shorter. Taller girls can use um, usually a bigger box. So staying low and tapping it back, okay? Remind them to get their full foot back on the box and to focus on their glutes, okay? Ooh. If they're cray cray, they can hold a handbag. Mm. Then we're going to go into our box dips. That's still the counter. Mm. Up and down. Can you see? Okay, good. Full extension of the arm. All right, so then we're coming into flamingo hold with a single arm curl and press. So lifting up that knee on the flamingo, curl and press. Keep their core nice and strong. Pull that knee up in alignment with the hip. Ugh. Mm, mm, mm. Curtsy pulse, again, five and five. Use that handbag, pulse for five, shoulders back, and switch, pulsing for five. Bomb.com, girl. Plank knee taps. I like these. I'm gonna come into a high plank. As far as balance goes, I have them step their legs out a little wider than hip distance so they're not too rocky. Coming into your high plank, and tapping opposite knee to hand together. Ooh. Are you watching? You got it? Okay. Uh, rope jacks, that's our jack with the rope. We know it. Let's see, bear pose with alternating knee taps. So, I marked it off, so I have to show you how to do it. So coming into tabletop, can you see me? Coming into tabletop, tucking the toes, engage your abs, neutral spine, Pull those knees up about two inches, and you're gonna alternate your tap side to side. 
okay? Tell them to focus on their oblique. So it looks like this, side to side. All right. Okay, so those are your on the line workouts. From there, you're going into one, two, three, four, four minute AMRAP. So depending on time, you may add a little bit of time or take away um, a few minutes. First one is froggers. Mm. Stepping your jumping in that high plank, step it up, booty low, or adding that jump. From there, sit up with an overhead press. Here you go. Take it down, press it up, flat spine, arms back. Nice strong shoulders on that one. Mm. Alternating V up, take it wide, alternate it up. Ooh. I'm getting heavier by the minute. Tricep push up. So, again, I have to emphasize this all the time. When they start this, their hand should be right under the shoulder. You want your inner arm to brush the sides of your rib cage. So, we're here and back down. So, usually on this one, I have to walk around the room and tuck everyone's elbows in nice and tight. Give them a little tap and they'll pull them in. Okay? Shoulder thrusters. I always do it with the squat. Drop it up and over. When they come up, remind them to squeeze their butt. Multitask as much as you can in the gym, not on the phone with your workout. Drive the bus, that's with your lighter handbag, right in front, drive the bus, drive. Mm -hmm. Next one we have our squat thrust. We should know that, girlfriend. Okay, but I'll show you. We jump or step it back, push up, and back in. Mm-hmm. We have our mountain climbers. Knees tapping down, sorry, feet tapping down, or all the way out to the sides. Then plank pike. So I always teach this with the elbows down onto the forearms. It's up to you if you do high plank. I always go low, pike it up. Ooh. Pull that tailbone nice and high. When you do that, when they do that, sorry, Remind them to really, really pull in their lower abs. Tell them something to focus on so they get through that exercise. Besides food, don't tell them to focus on food. Mm -mm. Um, chair hold with a heel lift. So chair, um, I like it here sometimes depending on how the knees feel. You can also bring it in, abs and strong, heel lift. Tell them to focus on balance on this one. Balance is more important than speed. Squat jumps, <laughs> nice soft landing. Squat and reach for um, modification. And last one, we have our push-ups. All right, girls, I hope you have a wonderful day. I hope you eat some veggies, and I'll see you soon. Bye.